Hi guys, I am back to do another review for you. I was asked by one of our sister girls on Instagram to do a review of my new makeup mirror. Well, here goes. The makeup mirror, um, I had a Zadro. Um, it's out in the living room. I think my husband wants to toss it out because he said it cannot be fixed. And I do need a lighted mirror on my vanity for detailing work and so on. So anyway, I needed to replace that mirror. Now, saw this one. This one is called the Ovente. It's a one time and 10 time magnification. So it has a regular side and a 10 time magnification side. This is pretty much what it looks like. I will show you the unit in a little bit. It is um, 7.5 inches tall. It says dual sided LED lighted mirror, diffused ring light, minimizes shadow, unique internal wiring allows safe rotation to any angle, dimmable light, natural bright white light, long lasting LEDs without changing bulbs. And there it gives the dimensions and it also has a dual USB adapter or you use four um, AA batteries. Okay, of course you can use it for your makeup, close shaving, dental care, eyebrow tweezing, contact lens insertion. These are the things that it says you can use it for. All right, but there goes the box. This is the unit. And you're going to pretty much see my messy vanity top for a minute. But this is the unit right here. Okay. And let me turn it this way so we don't keep probably blinding y'all. All right. This is your knob where you turn the unit on and off. I turned it on. So right now you can see there's light. And I'm going to turn it back off. Underneath the bottom, it has, I'm going to open it for you guys. I have four AA batteries in there because you can put AA batteries in there. It also comes with this charging um, thing. And it has two USB cables right here so it comes with a USB cable and you have an extra slot now the USB cable I have it strung beneath behind my vanity table and down to the floor so I don't want to pull it out but one end of the unit goes in here it's a five five um five point zero volt input five volt input and the little thingy goes right in here just plugs in here okay and so now that I have it disconnected from the USB to do the review this is how I'm able to get light because it has batteries in there as a backup so in thing is guys hear me and hear me good I like this I don't love it reason being is it's not as high, it's not as tall as I wanted it to be. Um, I thought definitely it would have been taller. So when it's on my vanity, as you can see right there, you see? So I'm sitting it on my shoulder just to give you an idea. And there, okay? So it's not that tall. It's not that tall, so I'm sitting here and I kind of have to bend this way. You know, I I have to bend and, and really get into the mirror to do what I want to do. Now, the other problem I have with this mirror is that the USB cable they send could have been longer because I have one of the IKEA Mickey desks and the desk is right next to the wall. It's like flush to the wall and then that space in front. Now I can only get the mirror to come to me halfway 
on the desk if you get where I'm going with that so it's in the middle and not only do I have to bend forward like this I have to go scooch up more so those two things I'm not liking the other thing is my Zadro was brighter the illumination that I got from the Zadro was so much brighter it, it had a much higher intensity when I turn it on and do the the lighting full flush now this watch this I turn it on this is full all right so this is full this is the full lighting that I get from it that's the full glow see now it's supposed to be dimmable but all right so that's full glow and I should be able to dim it dim 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 off it doesn't look that much different to me when I dim it from when I put it full blast on bright so am I I'm not completely happy with the mirror um, I kept the box because I said to myself I got it from Amazon Prime maybe I'll send it back it was 50 something dollars I think it's worth 20 something dollars the most 30 I'm serious so if you can find it for like $29, $25, I would say go for that if you want the same mirror. Now, on the plus side, I do like this part. I like, I kind of prefer the nickel finish, but it has a chrome finish to it. And it's okay. The chrome finish is, is, is all right. I, I really don't mind the chrome finish. It's just a magnet for fingerprint, but whatever. Um, that easily can be cleaned and I like the design here. It's not bulky. That's the one thing I like about it. It's not bulky. It's It has a smaller base here, so it's a smaller footprint on the vanity, whereas in my Zadro was a bigger footprint like this way, like, the, like this big. The Zadro was bigger, but it was also taller. So this has a smaller footprint and it is more of a minimalistic design so you're not feeling overcrowded so if you're looking for something that won't overcrowd your vanity space and you think you can work with this then it's a good mirror to have for me personally I wanted it to be a little bit higher I don't mind the lighting so much that it's not as bright as the old one but I do mind that the cord isn't as long as I wanted it to be. Um, I do mind that <clears throat> it's a little bit shorter, but I like the fact that it does not take up a lot of room on my vanity, that it has a small footprint. <clears throat> Excuse me. So for those things that I like about it being a smaller footprint and the fact that I can substitute the lighting, I'm keeping it. It's okay. I'll keep it. But would I purchase it when it go out, when it goes out, when it goes bad? No. Uh, no. I would just go back to buying another Zadro. Seriously. So if you girls think that this is a mirror that you you can make use of, then yeah. But for me, it's okay. It's okay. Um, that's it. Um, if you guys think that I've forgotten anything or anything else that I should have mentioned let me know but I think that I've covered everything um, if not you have questions that I didn't address leave your questions down below in the comment section and I'll be sure to respond to you all right take care guys thank you for watching bye